Today. Other interesting cultural news, you have Disney might be selling to ABC, or more accurately, they might be selling ABC. Now, it looks like they, again, this is according to uh, Bloomberg, where someone was, of course, anonymous, and it, they, uh, quote, held exploratory talks about selling ABC network and TV stations to Nextar Media. Now, Nextar Media is actually headquartered in the greatest state in the union, Texas, and they're one of the largest broadcasting companies that are so proudly owned to this, or no, actually, they're publicly traded, I digress. Now, it looks like, of course, neither Nextar nor Disney have publicly commented on the report. However, a couple months ago, Bob Iger did publicly say he doesn't think ABC and the TV networks may be core to their business. Kind of reading between the lines, or rather just straight up in those lines. Granted, I don't know how much you can trust them these days, but it seems like they may be serious about getting rid of that. And it's one of those things where this would help them get smaller to perhaps be acquired by Apple. That's a big speculation that's been around for years. And it's not the worst idea. Disney is, in terms of their management and their talent, they seem to be talentless. People say, my production is bad. <laughs> oh, 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 watch a Disney film these days. They lost about, what was it? What was it, 10, 12? A couple, no, no, $2 billion on films this year. Two billion dollars. That's terrible. And it's partially because they're drunk with power, perhaps the cost to make these films go up every single year. It's gotten to the point where the only way they can possibly make a profit is to have billions of box office sales and toy sales. But unfortunately, when you see the box office numbers, the financials are even worse than you think because that's not all going to Disney. That's also going to theaters like AMC and Cinemark. It's a revenue share. So even when you see the sales figures, oh yeah, this movie made $400 million. Well, that's how much was at the box office. That's split. And of course, whatever the cost to make the movie, usually on average, industry averages to double that for the advertising budget. So again, it gets the cost gets so astronomical, it's almost inconceivable for them to make a profit. So maybe it is time to just sell most of their assets to some company that has a modicum of business acumen. Let me know in the comments, do you think that'd be a good business sale? Spin off the TV channels that really are legacy channels. No one really, the amount of cable is decreasing every single year. And it would give them some quick cash that they desperately need. And maybe, maybe they can make Disney Plus, their streaming platform, profitable. It's still not yet. But this would help with that goal if they still want to go down that road. It'll be interesting to see where they go from here, though. Thank you, everyone, for taking the time to tune in. Again, I know it's ambitious trying to get to 4,000 subscribers by the end of September. So if you can click that button, I would greatly appreciate it. Also, the comments help the channel grow and develop. All the critique is greatly appreciated as I try to do everything from enunciate more, slowing down my voice, and still searching for better software so we can do the picture in picture with the video. I tried another one, but I don't know it's because of my newer 4K camera. It keeps crashing. So if you have suggestions, I would greatly appreciate them. And of course, don't forget to take the time to like the video because that helps with the algorithm and gives me feedback on if I need to maybe do something a little bit better. And also, don't forget to take the time to Tell your family, tell your friends, tell your coworkers. Heck, tell your enemies, tell anyone and everyone. Just stay safe and fight the good fight.